Good morning, you guys. It is Saturday morning. Welcome to Vlogmas, vlog number three. It's like 10 o'clock. I literally slept 10 hours almost and I feel incredible. I really needed that sleep in. I feel refreshed and just ready to start the day. So I'm gonna get out of bed soon. We're gonna do our tea of the day and coffee of the day, but I really wanna go to a new coffee shop and like try something. So I'm gonna do a little bit of research and find somewhere um, to go. Maybe I'll try and find one that's like walking distance, but it is like kind of cold and I feel like all the good ones are downtown. So I might have to go all the way downtown, but that's okay. It's Saturday and I have absolutely nothing else to do, so. Yeah. What type of person are you guys in the morning? Do you brush your teeth as soon as you wake up or do you brush your teeth after breakfast, after coffee? I'm the type of person I literally cannot brush my teeth. Like I have to brush my teeth first thing in the morning. I can't even have a sip of water if my teeth aren't brushed. It like grosses me out. So I always brush my teeth first thing in the morning, get it out of the way. And then I can like have my water, tea, coffee, all my liquids <laughs> that I need. But yeah. I also don't cleanse my face in the morning because I feel like it dries it out and I want to keep like the natural good oils on my skin so I just um, splash it with cold water to wake myself up. I'm gonna use my ice roller this morning so I'm gonna wait to do my skincare but otherwise I just splash my face with cold water and then I go right in to all my skincare and that's it. Keeps it very simple in the morning. I just find that if I use my cleanser in the morning, my skin gets so dry. So I recommend not if you have drier skin, especially in the winter. Okay, so it's time to find number four. Where is number four? Right here, English breakfast, perfect. Ooh, this thing is like falling. At this time of year, breakfast should be special as this tea is here. Okay. I'm excited. I like never have English breakfast tea, but I do actually quite like it. I just lit my little Fraser fur candle. You guys, this smells so good. I like don't love all the super, super strong Christmas smells. I find them a little bit like headachey and overpowering, but this one smells incredible. And I got the mini because like a huge candle would just smell my apartment up too much, but it smells so good. I have my little tree lit up with my little like winter bouquet. I love this little corner, it's so cute. But I'm gonna watch a little bit of Vlogmas videos now and catch up. open and see the coffee of the day i don't know if i'm gonna make it right now because i might go grab a coffee because it is saturday but let's see number four. Oh, it's a d okay so today's is a decaf so i think i'm gonna save it for later this afternoon when i want to make a second one um i'll probably just use this and it's not caffeinated so i'm gonna set that aside but that one is day four Alrighty guys, I just got dressed and ready for the day. We're gonna go to, I think, Coffee Lunar. I've heard that it's really good and it's kind of close-ish to me so I don't have to drive like super far. I'm wearing a very chill outfit. I'm wearing my Princess Polly um, jeans with the slits. I'm gonna wear my black and white Nike Dunks. Wearing my Be Well with Kayla hoodie that says you should care about your health on the back but you can't see it with my H&M little coat and then my new brown by far bag. And yeah, we're just gonna go on a little solo coffee date. I think my sister and I might be taking photos later on, but I think she might still be sleeping. So I'm just gonna go and get coffee by myself because I'm bored and I wanna get out of the house. It's sort of a beautiful day. It's like a little bright, but it's not super cold, which is always really nice. So let's go. You guys, it is 
cold out there. It's windy and I'm pretty sure it just started snowing. But I went to Coffee Lunar on Young, like near Summerhill. And the barista was actually very helpful, kind of asking me the kind of drinks that I normally like to get. And I said I typically do like a latte. So he suggested a mocha. I've never had a mocha, but I like coffee. I like hot chocolate. So I don't know why I would not like this. And I got it with oat milk. So let's try Ooh, that's really nice. Actually, it's not too sweet. It's kind of like a rich chocolate flavor, but in a good way. So I really like this. It's snowing. I don't really know if you guys can tell, but it's snowing. Okay, guys. So I've been home for like 20 minutes probably, and I'm going to head back out. I'm going to Ikea, which honestly I might regret because it's literally a Saturday afternoon. I feel like it's just going to be a disaster so busy traffic getting there whatever but i'm kind of desperate at this point because i need a desk i ordered a desk over a month ago from wayfair and it said it would take about three weeks to ship and i was like okay that's fine it was supposed to come on monday then i got an email saying that it was delayed then it said that the expected ship date was or the expected delivery date was yesterday still didn't arrive i checked the tracking the label was scanned by fedex on november 18th and it has not moved since which was two weeks ago almost three weeks ago so I think it's just going to be another like at least two weeks before it comes and my exams are next week and I need a desk because all of this was from my desk and it's on my counter. It's making everything a mess. This entire room is stressing me out and it's a mess. So I found a desk on Ikea that I like and I'm going to go and get it today and build it because I just can't wait anymore. Like it's honestly causing me too much stress and anxiety. I feel like my apartment is never clean because I don't have anywhere to put anything because I don't have a desk. So I'm gonna go there. I have my eye on a specific one. If I see one that I like better, maybe I'll get that one. But I think that the one that I have been looking at is like easier to build and it's just me. So I'm looking for one that is simple enough to build. So we're gonna head over there. It's like a 30 minute drive away, but it's fine. And the desk is really cheap too. So. I'm just gonna go. I was gonna order it for curbside pickup tomorrow because that's the earliest time available, but I have nothing to do until like 6.30 tonight. So I may as well be productive and just grab the desk and build it and be done so I can organize because the clutter is just too much for me right now. So we're gonna head over there. Okay, I got the desk. You guys are like on my dash where like my speedometer is. I know it's a horrible angle. I just ordered a um, like a camera mount for the car. So I'm going to install that soon and like see if it works because I feel like I'm always in the car and I want to vlog But I have no place in my car to like rest the camera while I'm driving So we're gonna figure that out, but I got the desk. I literally was in and out of Ikea within 20 minutes So I'm pretty impressed with myself It honestly is a good place to just go and get your steps um, because, Oh my gosh it's honestly a good place to go and get your steps because I literally was just walking around the entire thing um, to like the end. But I got the desk that I went in there for and I'm gonna build it. It's like low key smaller than I thought. So I guess we're just gonna see how it is. Um, we'll hope that it works out okay. But yeah, I was very impressed with myself that I was in and out so quickly. It was definitely a success, so I'm happy about that, and I will do like a time lapse of me building it. Also, it's so windy out today, literally on the highway. My car was getting like blown to the side. Like it's so windy, it was literally pushing the car, which is kind of insane. But anyways, I will see you guys back at the apartment. Going to Ikea and transporting furniture on your own is literally so hard, but I'm back. This is, oops. This is the name of the desk that I got, if you guys are interested in the same one once you see it built. But I'm gonna attempt to build it. I really hope that it's easy because I don't have the mental capacity to like spend four hours building a desk. Here she is. 
There's three drawers. Okay, I need to clear out this space now and put it in. Okay. Here is the desk. I honestly should have measured this chair, which I did not. So the chair doesn't go all the way under, but I feel like it's okay if I just kind of leave it like that. Like, you know, I still have plenty of space to come in here and walk and whatever. So here's the desk. It actually looks really cute. It's clean. I like the wood surface. In this drawer, I just put all my pens and like random stuff. In here, I just have some tech things, my hard drive, my SD card thing, headphones, and then in here, I just have my journal, some notebooks, and tape. But like, it really holds everything that was like on the floor here, and that was over here also. So I need to bring the box down, then I can clean this entire island. I'm just heating some of these egg bites up as like a very late-ish lunch slash snack. Um, tonight I'm going to like holiday lights at Casa Loma with my family and our reservation is for 7.30 cause that was the only time they had. So it's kind of like in the middle of dinner time. So I think we're going for dinner before super early at like 5.45, 6. So I'm gonna have snack now because that's only in like two hours from now and I wanna be able to like eat out and have enough room for a nice dinner. So I'm gonna have this snack now. My apartment is spotless and I'm so happy about it. Okay guys, it's about seven o'clock. I am heading to Casa Loma with my mom and my sister. They have like a holiday lights event outside for the holidays, obviously. I think it's just like a light show, a bunch of, a bunch of Christmas trees, something like that. So obviously I'm bringing you guys with me and we're going for dinner after. So I thought I would show you my outfit. So under here I have this little knit scarf from Aritzia, very like Christmassy. These leather pants also from Aritzia. I don't know if you can tell. There's like a line detailing. I think these are the Rebel Pant. My Doc Martens Chelsea boots. This scarf from Aritzia. My um, my H and M coat. I also have a I also have a hat in this bag, which is like a cream knit hat. It's the same bag I was wearing earlier today. And yeah, I hope this keeps me warm enough. It's definitely colder, but I don't want to wear my puffer just because like it kind of ruins the outfit, you know. So. This is what we're going with, but the hat will definitely keep me warm. So I will see you guys there. I'm excited to see all the pretty festive lights. It's actually pretty. This thing is from Halloween. It's freezing. We have to wear masks outside, but at least it's keeping my face warm. Wait, this I Good morning, you guys. It's Sunday morning. <laughs> I can't believe that it's already Sunday, but I had a very like eh kind of sleep last night. I don't know about you guys, but I swear when I go out to dinner and I'm so full, like it takes me so long to fall asleep just because I'm so full. I just like feel like I can't relax, but last night was really fun. We went to the light show. It was actually pretty cute. It was a whole like hour basically. And then we went to dinner to like a little Italian place near me. We ended up going for dinner at like nine because we called so many different places before and they were all full. Um, so we, I got back from dinner at like 10 and 30, 10 45. So it was pretty late, but it was a yummy dinner. Got to spend some time with my mom and my sister. And this morning I've just been ice rolling a little bit and watching some vlogmas vlogs and catching up. And now I want to have my tea of the day, so. Today is number five, which like time is moving quick <laughs> Okay, so what we're looking for Number five Supreme matcha green Interesting. I've definitely never tried this one before Here's a cup to make you feel supreme organic matcha and tea the purest green Okay, so let's give this a go Okay now let's take a look at the coffee of the day. Five is right here. Inspiracion Napoli. I want some of like the fun flavors. I don't know why it's taking so long to get there. These are just like the originals, but I want like the vanilla or something like that. But anyways, this is the coffee of the day. I'm going to drink my tea and then we're going to we're gonna make this. 
I haven't had oats in so long and this morning I was just craving like a warm cozy bowl So I am cooking up some oats I'm gonna add some maple syrup some walnuts and some peanut butter and some fresh fruit on top All right, guys, I just got ready for the day. Sorry if you can hear the office in the background, but I'm literally just gonna be heading to Home Depot with my mom and I think grabbing lunch. So I'm wearing something very chill. Let me actually show you in this mirror and ignore my messy bed. I'm changing my sheets. So I just, I'm not gonna make it, but I'm wearing these leggings from Aritzia. They're gray. I love them. They're so comfortable with just a cropped t-shirt under and this little green cropped fleece from Aritzia as well. And I'm gonna wear my Uggs with it. Very comfy, cozy, chill, and warm. I got my favorite salad from Impact. The Zesty Mexican. Guys, it's so freaking good. Oh my gosh. Hi you guys, it's been a couple of hours. I went home to hang out with my family for a little bit. And then I went to Lowe's with my mom because she had to run some errands and now i'm back home i'm drinking this united sodas of america pear elderflower soda it's so good they just became available at summer hill market if you guys are based in toronto i don't think they're sold anywhere else in canada but it's like all natural ingredients only six grams of sugar um they use like fruit and stuff for the coloring and everything so the ingredients are a lot better than a typical soda it's really good sorry if you can hear my laundry in the back but i'm on my second load of laundry i'm probably just gonna have like a canned soup for dinner because i don't have very many groceries and i kind of just want something quick and easy and comforting so i think i'm gonna end off the vlog here because i'm not doing anything for the rest of the night and i wanted this vlog this vlog to be um just a weekend one so i'm gonna continue and start up a new vlog tomorrow which is monday which is my first exam so this week is gonna be exam week i am definitely gonna be starting to get back into working out i just haven't been at all and i'm really feeling it i don't feel my best um so tomorrow morning monday morning we're starting off we're gonna do a workout i have to do it i just need to push myself to get back into it it's always so hard to restart but i'm gonna do it but anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed spending this weekend with me. I will see you in the next vlog. Don't forget to subscribe, like the video, follow me on all my socials that will be on the screen here. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye!